Hey folks, this is Pastor David Grisham with uh, Last Frontier Evangelism, and you can contact us at lastfrontierevangelism at gmail.com. You can also find these videos up under Last Frontier Evangelism on YouTube and Facebook. Today I would like to do this little how-to video on how to witness to a military person. Now, Generally speaking, a military person that's an atheist or agnostic or whatever, you can just use the atheist or agnostic technique. But if you find a military person, as we have many times in the past, who claims to be a Christian, and yet you catch them going in and out of a bar, or like we did at spring break when we first started using this technique, we found soldiers who were claiming to be Christian and they were getting drunk or they were fornicating with their girlfriend. So if you find someone like that, this technique works great for that. What I'll use the example of a Marine, since that's the first guy I used this technique on. He told me that he was a Marine, and this was at spring break in South Padre Island, and he was getting drunk at spring break at the beach. And so basically he told me that he was a Christian, but this particular week he was letting his hair down, he was having a good time, and he was just kind of taking a break. And so I asked him this question. I said, now, uh, let's say you've got a Marine and he's serving in Afghanistan fighting against the Taliban. Now, if this Marine is putting on the uniform of a Marine one day and then at night, and fighting against the Taliban, and then at night he's putting on the, the uniform of the Taliban and he's making explosive devices to blow up Marines is he a loyal Marine? And he said, absolutely not. And he got really offended by even the question because this disloyalty offended him so much and because military people understand loyalty. So this is where you're coming from with this technique. As Paul said, be all things to all men, right? So he got offended with it. And I said, well, now if would he would be guilty of what? Being a traitor? Guilty of treason? And he said, absolutely. And I said, what would his penalty be? And he said, death. He deserves to die. And I said, that's exactly right. Because the United States military, the United States Marine Corps requires 100% loyalty. Does it not? And he said, absolutely. I said, what makes you think the kingdom of God has any requirement that's less than that? What makes you think the kingdom of God requires less loyalty? You think the standard for God is lower than the United States military or the Marine Corps? So if you go to church on Sundays and you put on the uniform of a Christian and you raise your hands and say, praise Jesus, and then you go out on Saturday nights and you get drunk or you fornicate or you go out to spring break and have a good time partying, living like a demon, an enemy of God the Taliban, so to speak, as compared to God, do you think that God will not hold you to the same standard of disloyalty? And do you not think that he will not give you the penalty of death, which is hell? And the young man stood there with his eyes wide open like I had slapped his face. We have used this technique out on the streets and it is very, very effective for military people. And if you will find someone, especially who is, you know, a Comes, claims to be a Christian and a military person, you catch them in sin, getting drunk at a bar, fornicating with their girlfriend or something along those lines, then this technique works very well because you're basically doing what Jesus did. You're actually taking that which is in the natural and applying it to that in the spiritual, using a natural example for, to teach a spiritual truth. That's exactly what Jesus did. So anyway, Tune in again to Last Frontier Evangelism on YouTube or on Facebook and look for these videos there. And also, if you want to contact us and ask more questions about this technique or anything else that we teach, uh, contact us at lastfrontierevangelism at gmail.com. And we will come to your church no matter where you are. We will come there and we will teach you how to do evangelism if you want to learn that, if you want your congregation to learn that. Anyway, this is Pastor Dave Grisham with Last Frontier Evangelism. Last Frontier Evangelism. God bless you and have a good day.